welcome to our new series, Short and Sweet, your five minute guide to everything camping, full driving and auto electrical. We'll be releasing one video in this series every single week, so make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss any. And to kick things off, let's talk five ways to get better fuel economy from your four wheel drive. Number one, tire pressures. We all know how important keeping an eye on your tire pressures is when you're off road. Lowering your tires allows them to mold and conform around the terrain, giving you more traction and preventing you from getting bogged. But the fact is, tires that aren't properly reinflated when you hit the tarmac at the end of the day can be seriously costing you at the Bowser. When was the last time you checked your tire pressures? If you're like us, it was probably the last time you aired your tires back up, right? Any number of things can cause a tire to lose pressure in the meantime, like dirt in the tire bead, dirt in the valve core, or tire damage. Our own testing has shown that a tire that's as little as five PSI under its recommended inflation can increase fuel economy by up to 10%, and that's per tire. Number two, clean your four wheel drive. If you're like us, then you love getting out onto those low range tracks and giving your four wheel drive a workout. But those muddy tracks can seriously cost you in the long run, long after the mud's dried up and you're back home from your trip. Keeping your four wheel drive clean doesn't sound like it'll contribute much to fuel economy, but it's not what's on the outside, it's what's underneath. Give your four wheel drive a good underbody clean after every trip, particularly if it's been muddy. If you don't, you'll substantially increase driveline wear, particularly brakes and uni joints. When these wear, they cause excess drag on the driveline, which leads to unnecessary fuel usage. Number three, keep your wheels balanced and aligned. Tip number three is also extremely relevant to those who hit the low range tracks regularly. In fact, if you've done just a single heavy off-road trip where you've pushed your vehicle to its limits, there's a good chance you may be using more fuel than necessary without even knowing it. If you regularly head off-road for the tough low range tracks, there's a good chance your tyres are out of balance due to mud buildup or loss of wheel weights. There's also just as good a chance your steer tyres are out of alignment due to bent steering components. These issues mean that your full drive won't roll down the road as easily as it should, which means you'll have to sink your boot in more, and that means the fuel gauge will go down quicker. Number four, keep on top of mechanical issues. But it doesn't matter if you don't do a lot of low range four wheel driving either, because the truth is that the more that four wheel drives wear over time, the more often things can go wrong mechanically. If you're ignoring mechanical issues under the bonnet, then you're almost certainly using more fuel than you need to. The further your four wheel drive is away from running optimally, the less power it'll produce, meaning you'll be pushing it harder unnecessarily. If you've got a modern four wheel drive with an EGR system or a DPF exhaust, make sure they're clean and functioning as they should or you'll literally choke your engine. And that old trick of removing the thermostat to fix an overheating problem? When it's cold, all it does is take much longer for your four wheel drive to warm up, so it'll be running rich for longer than it should. Number five, driving style. The fifth and final tip is one that won't cost you a cent. In fact, it'll save you big time every single time you fuel up. Driving style is a huge contributing factor to how much fuel your vehicle uses, and it's so easy to forget that every time you hit the accelerator harder than you should, you're literally blowing dollars straight out your exhaust pipe. The biggest thing you can do to affect fuel economy is to relax your driving style. Pretend there's a rusty nail under the throttle and keep your right foot away from it as long as possible. Knock 10 kilometers an hour off your highway speed and leave a little earlier if you can, or get into camp half an hour later. But the key point I'm making here is the harder you push your four wheel drive, the more fuel you'll use. Well, there you go. Five ways to get better fuel economy from your four wheel drive. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to ensure you don't miss the rest of the series.